Playing for the Mets, you know, and being a hometown guy, I think it's, I think it, I think it definitely does help me. You know, want to succeed for, you know, not just me, but you know, the hometown. My first pitch, I was thinking in my head, just throw this pitch right down the middle. You're just not used to it. There's so much more like volume, you know, noise-wise and everything, and your adrenaline just kind of going. And you're, I'm telling myself to calm down, but it's just you can't help yourself. Phillips rocks one out to left field, headed toward the wall, and it's off the top of the fence. It is a home run leading off the game. And so thus is Steven Matz ushered into the major leagues. It was almost a relief. Got the first batter out of the way, done with that, down to business. Um, and he got down to business. The rookie winding and firing. Swing and a miss, he got him! To have all his friends and family, to, you know, to be an hour from the ballpark and watch him play with the hometown team is pretty exciting. With it being a hometown fan base, I think that you couldn't pile on any, you know, more pressure from that standpoint. It really is impressive the way that Steve has handled that throughout his entire career. We are Mets fans through and through. My entire family growing up, always big Mets fans. My late wife and her mother were two great Mets fans. And uh, you know, they, they would watch a game no matter how bad the Mets were doing from start to finish. My grandmother, she was a big Mets fan. And she worked in a deli. The Mets used to have a thing, save 10 things off a milk cart and get a free ticket to the Mets game. She would save all the milk cartons, cut them all up till she could bring the whole family. We kind of had an idea that they were interested in him, and then as it got closer, they showed more and more interest, so it was pretty pretty exciting when it came down to the wire. We all knew it was gonna happen, the way things were going. Uh, when it happened, I got the phone call, I had, the tears started coming, and uh, they were happy tears, I guess you could call them. Yeah, yeah. started with rehab and I rehabbed for like two and a half years so it was just kind of like man will I ever will I ever make it out there so how is this is this tender at all no right. it feels good and again we'll get you for uh, lower body tomorrow and then another um, upper body day with me on Saturday I got drafted and it was like all great and then I got hurt and then I missed all that time and it's the same aspect as in I got called up to the major leagues I got a little taste and now I'm hurt down here I kind of knew what to expect and, you know, just got to stay as focused as I can and try to get back. Yes, okay, so um, the word I got from Allcheck was that, uh, you know, you're going to be cleared um, no sooner than Monday to throw, and that's assuming that everything feels good. You know, missing like two years, it helped me a little bit of kind of like mentally maturing, how to deal with failure, how to deal with the success, game by game, start by start. All right, gentlemen, good morning. Just want to go over today's schedule very quickly as it relates to strength and conditioning. It was definitely tough, but um, you know, I had a good support system. My family was great. Oh, his debut was amazing. So they're gonna potentially walk Campbell. Well, that's gonna bring Mats to the plate, and Mats. Is... I hate when pitchers go up the plate and they're just an easy out because it's still a big part of the game is that ninth hitter. We're sitting up in the uh, box there, and there was a gentleman in the box next to me, and. They passed the guy, they gave him an intentional walk to pitch to Steve. And I said to the guy, I says, bad move. It's this one to center field. Hamilton going back, it's turned around, and it's over his head! Steven Metz with a double! I, we really couldn't ask for more. Not square, pulls one off the ground, through the hole with a runner going. Out of like that! Metz singles through the area that Suarez vacated. And I knew he was going for the fences every time he's at bat. Breaking ball line to right center, that's a base hit! Steven Matz is on at first. He is three for three in his major league debut. He has driven in four. That's just my grandpa, he's just, he's the best. He's a real funny guy and it was just perfect. Somebody interviewed him and they said, do you know you've gone viral? And he's like, viral, is that contagious? <laughs> 
I had a couple of ladies uh, asking for dates, but I told them, I said, uh, uh, I'm not available. <laughs> They're standing in unison at City Field. One of the most memorable Mets debuts in franchise history will come to an end. And listen to this crowd react. Having a little taste, and I know it's there. Just got to stay healthy. I've got, I'm looking forward to, uh, uh, as they say, a great ride on this one.